Yes, we're going to a desert city. <laughs> this is also one of the best songs in the game. Hot. It's so hot. It's hotter than two Khmer's mating in a boiler room. What? I'm burning up, old man. Aren't we there yet? Um, Mr. Glossner? We're not that far away from Siam Sid, are we? Huh, you youngins are pitiful. How can you be all ready to dry up after a scant 30 miles? This barely qualifies as a hike. Anyhow, we'll see Siam Sid on the horizon soon enough. Mm -hmm. Exactly what kind of town is Siam Sid? Well, it's nothing but ruins now. But in ancient times, it was a large city that thrived as a royal capital. Yep. Yeah. One of your books said everyone in Lebus was wiped out in a single night. I remember hearing a story like that as a kid. It's not just a story. Lebus was destroyed overnight by golems. By golems? <laughs> yeah. It's ironic how a civilization that thrived by the Grand Arcanum would perish by it as well. You see, the King of Lebus committed a forbidden act. That's what ultimately caused Lebus' destruction. What do you mean by a forbidden act? Human transmutation. It was the reign of Lebus' 32nd King. After the Queen died from a plague, the King tried to bring her back to life. Using alchemy? Precisely. The Grand Arcanum of Lebus. The king tried to bring his queen back to life by using a golem body and breathing life into it. But the king was unsuccessful. Still, he couldn't give up. He tried again and again to revive the queen. He created countless queen golems, all of which were failures. But then, one day... His queen golem went berserk, became a monster, and went on a rampage of murder and destruction. Then, as if in response to the queen, the other golems went berserk as well, and in a single night. No way. That's incredible. Yes, incredible indeed. The ancient method of creating golems is both flawed and extremely dangerous. That's why I've got to stop Crowley. He's taking the same path as the King of Lebus. This can't continue. Actually, this could be a really... It could have been an actual arc in, in the show, to be honest. Like, if this came out around that time, then yes, this could have been a filler arc, maybe. In between the canon events that we're going through before, you know, everything else happened. You know, like the first game could have happened after this one, but they didn't plan that, I don't think. Gramps, I, uh... I think I see something up ahead. Mr. Glossner, could that be... Yes, it's the city. Huh? <laughs> well, I'll be damned. That's definitely Siam Sid. It's sure been a while. You mean we're almost there? All right, last one there's Rodden Egg. I'm talking to you, Al. Huh? Oh, Ed, you don't have to run. This is Siam Sid, royal capital of the ancient civilization of Levis, huh? Yeah. Um, Gramps? Those aren't people. Not to question your inexhaustible knowledge or anything, but wasn't this town destroyed centuries ago? My god, this can't be possible! Are you sure this is Siam Sid? 
There's... there's no doubt about it. You can see the ultimate proof in front of us. That's why I'm so surprised. I guess it's possible that people came back to the ruins and rebuilt the town while you weren't looking. The repopulation isn't what bothers me. It's how the spire has been restored. Things may not be exactly normal here, but finding Crowley should be our concern for now. Sure. That's right. Let's see if any of the natives can clue us in on Crowley. Excuse me. Hey, I just wanted to ask. You know anything about a guy named Crowley? Silver hair, evil stare. Hey, hey, wait a minute. I'm talking to you, pal. Well, so that's how it is around here, huh? You got some nerve ignoring me when I'm trying to have a conversation. Cool it, Ed. They're not ignoring you. It looks like they don't speak your language. My language? But I can't speak... Labizic? <laughs> well, that's why we have Mr. Glossner to help us. Huh? Ed! Ed! Look over there! <laughs> oh my god. I don't speak... Labizic. That's her! Come on, Al! W wait Huh? Oh, my God. That can't be. <laughs> oh. That's it. This can't be a coincidence anymore. Just who are you, and what do you want with us? Lebus? You mean that tower over there? And... Are you talking about Crowley? Please... Stop... him. Time to step into that portal. Never mind. That ain't a portal, that's a transportation circle. Again. She just vanished into thin air. Just what is going on here? Alma, was that you? Huh? Uh, something a matter, Gramps? It was you, wasn't it, Alma? Then Crowley must be here too. I'm not gonna Mr. tell you what. Losner? I don't want to tell you his relation to her specifically. Alma! Crowley! Wait! Sir! Great! And now those two are gone! Brother, please tell me you know what's going on. Mm -hmm. This transmutation circle must be some sort of transport method. That's why they all disappeared. It looks like the formula is written in ancient runes, but it can't be all that different from what we use now. Yeah, okay, I see. This formula shouldn't be harmful to the body. Should we go in? Well, we'd survive more irresponsible predicaments than this. Cross your fingers, Al. Oh boy. Well, it's time to go. Ugh. Feels like 
My stomach just got shot out of a cannon. Are you okay, brother? You better make sure you weren't missing anything. Nah, I'm intact. Just a little loopy. But wow, using alchemy as a means of transportation. This Grand Arcanum is pretty amazing. I ought to take some time to study this once our job is done. So, where did we pop up anyway? Uh, we popped up in the middle of this castle. Or the wall. <laughs> the chest is conveniently sitting there. Judging by the decor, I think we're still within Siam Sid. We gotta find the Lieutenant Gramps first. What was that geezer thinking diving in head first like that? Did it seem to you that Mr. Glossner knew that lady? Well, we'll find out as soon as we join those two. If we can find them, that is. Let's get cracking! Hmm, okay, now this is where I'm gonna need items, so I'm gonna have to take that thing from Al and put it on myself. Alright, alright, I am set to go. <laughs> there we go. That is definitely good because I don't have to, you know, rely on Al to kill people to get items anymore. Let's save. Alright, 5 hours 47 minutes, that is not too bad. I can set my own record time here. Or possibly do even better. Alright. Ed, look what we dropped in on. It's in the city. See? As well as, you know... A pipe! Wait, this belongs to Gramps! Yep. That means the lieutenant and Mr. Glossner came this way. Then we're on the right track. All right, let's try to catch up. Aren't we going to pick up his pipe? <laughs> hmm. I don't want to I don't want to get those bombs without knowing what I'm going to do first. Oh, let me ah uh, these characters <laughs> yeah they didn't even try with these character models I don't think nope they're literally the same character models just recycle it over and over again well that's fairly common all right anything over here yep there's a there's a chest right here I'm gonna get as much stuff as I can from this city because oh full metal earring Dang, they are flooding me with elixirs here. Which is actually very good. So, yeah. <laughs> Elixir large. Jeez. Hey, look, it's a cat. Yeah, if you start, um, <laughs> oh my God. yes, if you okay, here's what I forgot to tell you, um. Those are found in New Game Plus files, so basically, if I beat the game, well, I am beating the game, but trust me, when I do, uh, god dang it. Hey, it's Lieutenant Hawkeye, and Mr. Glossner's with her. Hold on. Jeez, I thought we'd never catch up. You're both fine? What a relief. I'm sorry, I wanted to wait until you two caught up with us, but Mr. Glossner was quite adamant. Oh, 
All right, listen up, you geezer. You're not the center of the universe, so stop brushing us off, you hear? Ed never likes it when someone else gets to be the center of the universe. <laughs> Ahem. Don't you have something to say? Crowley's in the spire. Let's go! What? Wait! Didn't you hear what I just said? <laughs> What's up with these guys? Did the whole town get up on the wrong side of the bed? It looks like they're guarding the ruins. Keep in mind, this is an important relic to them. They might think we're grave robbers or something. <sighs> okay, listen, we're good, clean-cut boys and girls, you got it? Now, if you'll just let us through... I said, we're not here to loot your crappy old graves, all right? That didn't work. Hold on. Something's not quite right here. Uh. You don't think there could be that many of them? Uh, I don't know. That moan is starting to ring a bell. <laughs> Mr. Glossner! Gramps! Are you all right? Look, now the chests are completely closed again. Die here. Not yet. Ow! Ready, Ed. Distract these guys. Lieutenant, take Gramps and get out of here. We'll catch up with you soon. Please hurry. Okay, boys, we're counting on you. Mr. Gl Don't keep us waiting, kid. All right, Al. We gotta buy as much time as we can for those two. Okay, Golems, come get some. Okay, now back to what I was saying. Okay, back to what I was saying. Um, when you're near the end of your first run, you'll always find that cat right there. Like, I'm just letting you know that. You know, just in case any of you want to play it, there you go. Yeah, this is where Al starts to die a lot. <laughs> It's no use! 
It's like they're respawning no matter what we do. You're right. I think they've had more than enough time to escape. We should get out of here too. Yeah.